Hartford man is now behind bars, charged with killing a toddler in a hit and run. That little girl wandered out of a laundromat on New Britain Avenue last month. News aides Ken Pierce live in Hartford this morning with the very latest on the arraignment. Good morning, Ken. Lauren and Keith, good morning. It was about 11 p.m. the night of June 3rd when this year and a half old girl wandered out of the open door of that laundromat there and out into the street here on New Britain Avenue. 30-year-old Melvin Daniels happened to be driving by the Top Cat laundromat at just that moment. He hit the little girl, 19-month-old Camilla Elizabeth Ramirez Camaro, according to police, killing her and then driving off. Court documents reveal Daniels once worked as a mental health advisor. They say he drove to his apartment, checked for possible damage to his 2013 BMW, and ended up driving to New Haven. Police eventually tracked him down in a McDonald's parking lot off Kimberly Avenue where he was asleep behind the wheel of his car. Daniels has a history with police. He pled guilty to disorderly conduct in 2022. He failed to appear in court and was on a two-year conditional discharge when this happened last month. He faces three new charges as of yesterday. Second-degree manslaughter, evading responsibility involving death, and having an illegally tinted windshield. Authorities say that illegally illegal tint on his windshield was so dark that they think he didn't see little Camilla as she walked out the door and into the street, possibly because she was also wearing a dark dress and it was the middle of the night. Live in Hartford this morning, I'm Kent Pierce. Back to you.